of the future, we have, as uh, people watching might know, quite a few uh, modern pieces of technology for the kids um, that, are, that are really fun and interesting and challenge them. And that includes things like uh, virtual reality headsets they can wear. Um, and interact with each other. We have something called cubelets, which are small modular robots that you can build different things out of. So it teaches them about, um, you know, how to incorporate technology you know, into you know, the modern world and coding as well, which is, is a big part of it. So obviously you're a little, little bit older than our, our young kids, <laughs> if you don't mind me saying, but how important do you think it is for them to be taught that kind of, uh, information or that syllabus at that age so technology when it comes to you know virtual reality and coding and that kind of thing yeah i think it's good for children you know like when i was a kid i didn't study something like this so it's hard to find out what i like so mm. kids at, at the moment have a chance to know what they like faster yeah, yeah and they can develop in the future about technology do you, would you, when you were that age, when you were younger, do you think it would have been useful to have access to that, that technology, that information? Yeah, of course, yeah. It would be good if I can study that. Yeah. Great. Well, at Mark for Future, we uh, pride ourselves, again, in having sort of modern, up-to-date technology for the students' purposes. So there's a lot of iPads which are around the room right now. Um, we, so in terms of hardware, we have that, we have um, you know, Pioneer DJing equipment, we have lots of, of physical equipment, you know, uh, musical instruments uh, and computers that they can use. The reason I mention this is I wanted to know with your role, what you're studying through uh, in game development, what's, how, how do you go about it? What, what do you use in terms of the hardware and the software? Yeah, I use the computer to, to make the game because it's faster than iPad, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and I use um, like this one. It's a uh, oh, wow. okay. Wacom that, that I can draw in it, yeah. So this is like a huge kind of uh, art pad, but a te uh, uh, what do you call it, a, um, a technological yeah. art pad? Yeah, yeah. tablet, yeah, okay. something like that. Tablet, yeah. yeah. <laughs> And so do you, what software do you use? How do you, how do you draw the character? Yeah, so I use Photoshop to draw it. Yeah. Okay. But I have another program to, to do for 3D, like Maya, Sirbrush, yeah. And for developer game, I use Unreal and Unity. Okay, so those are, those are like the actual design uh, software yeah. packages mm -hmm. you use. How do you, how do you get it from like Photoshop into the game? How do you, how do you get your character when it's ready? into the game. Is that a different program or different, different way of doing yeah, it? Yes, so, so first you have to s draw it in the Photoshop and after you finish it, you have to import to like PNG or JPEG. Okay. Yeah, uh, and import to Unity or Unreal to make the game. And then that's in 3D, yeah, as well? So it's like a 3D character? Yeah, 3D, you can use Maya instead of Photoshop. Yeah. Right, okay, that's cool. So Rui, we just had the workshop with our primary students. Thank you for, for giving that workshop. Yeah. Uh, how did it go and how do you feel about it? Yeah, it's good. Like, students pay attention to me and they listen to me. So I think they want to have the expert, know how to make the games, yeah. So they, you, you felt they were interested in, in, in what you showed them and in, in game development maybe as a future career, who knows? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Great. It's good to hear that. <laughs> Rue, it's been a pleasure talking to you. Yeah. Uh, nice to meet you and thank you very much for your time yeah, and thank uh, you. for, for showing us your skills and what you, uh, you do. And I wish you all the, the best of luck in, in what you're doing and I hope to play one of your games again in the future. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks very much for, uh, for coming to Mark the Future. Thanks for yeah. watching. Stand, stand, stand. I want to be a scientist. Stem, stem, stem. I want to be a technologist. Stem, stem, stem. I want to be an engineer. Stem, stem, stem. I want to be a mathematician. I want to help build the future. And I want to help build the future. STEM, STEM, STEM Let's have fun and learn STEM at Mark for Future STEM, STEM, STEM I wanna be a 
scientist. STEM, STEM, STEM. Ooh. I want to be a technologist. STEM, STEM, STEM. Ooh. I want to be an engineer. STEM, STEM, STEM. Ooh. I want to be a mathematician. I want to help build the future. And I want to help build the future. STEM, STEM, STEM. Let's have fun and learn STEM and mark for future. STEM, STEM, STEM. I want to be a scientist. STEM, STEM, STEM. I want to be a technologist. STEM, STEM, STEM. STEM, STEM, STEM I want to be a mathematician I want to help build the future And I want to help build the future STEM, STEM, STEM Let's have fun and learn STEM at Mark for Future Scientist. STEM, STEM, STEM. Ooh. I want to be a technologist. STEM, STEM, STEM. Ooh. I want to be an engineer. STEM, STEM, STEM. Ooh. I want to be a mathematician. I want to help build the future. And I want to help build the future STEM, STEM, STEM Let's have fun and learn STEM at Mark for Future STEM, STEM, STEM I want to be a scientist STEM, STEM, STEM I want to be a technologist STEM, STEM, STEM I want to be an engineer STEM, STEM, STEM I want to be a mathematician I want to help build the future And I want to help build the future STEM, STEM, STEM Let's have fun and learn STEM at Mark for Future. STEM, STEM, STEM. I want to be a scientist. STEM, STEM, STEM. เราอยากให้มันออกงานหน้าตาลักษณะไหนอ่าสมมุติว่าเราแบบอยากได้หน้าตาประมาณลักษณะนี้เราก็อาจจะแบบอ่าเรื่องมาก็ต้องแบบบล็อกกิ้งก่อนแล้วแบบเรื่องแบบเฮ้ยตัวละครเรามันจะสูงประมาณนี้มันจะมีแบบอุปกรณ์อะไรติดตัวบ้างแขนขายาวเท่าไหร่จากนั้นเนี่ยพอเราแบบได้นี้เสร็จเราก็จะแบบไอปั้นเนาะเป็นโมเดลให้แบบสุดท้ายมันก็กลายเป็นอย่างนี้แล้วก็สุดท้ายเนี่ยเราก็จะโมเดลเนี้ยไปใส่ในเกมเราก็จะได้แบบตัวละครเราอยู่ในเกมแล้วอะไรประมาณนี้ครับ Let's have fun and learn STEM at Mark for Future